poppin' fools. It's your boy Mark the Shark, and we are back. Episode 91 of Borrow You Squad Road to Glory. And today, you guys, we're into January now. We got a lot of things to cover, got a lot of things to do. It's very congested and tight um, schedule for this one. I will say that. And uh, it starts today with Chelsea in the Carabao Cup semi final leg one and uh yeah we got we got some shit to take care of uh today's lineup of games is chelsea here to start it off leicester city after that liverpool and manchester city uh along the way as well and if you guys haven't noticed already in the uh news feed and the transfer uh, the transfer scrolling thing that's going down where the top scores is at, at the moment. We did make a new signing, and this is him. Barrow have signed God's Will Solomon Otobor from Everton for thirteen thousand. Uh, I mean, thirteen million. Excuse me, not thirteen thousand. I wish it was only thirteen thousand, but thirteen million pounds for or 30 million euros for god's will solomon otobor a backup left mid that will suit nicely to try and get us over the hump of champions league i have great re, uh, great respect for ross Cavanaugh, but i want to use him in a different role and god's will will take over that left winger spot so we're gonna go in and get the damn thing rolling now well, here we go, you guys. We have our starting 11 ready and set to go for this game here at Stamford Bridge. The first leg of the EFL Cup semifinals. We have uh, God's Will Solomon Otobor getting his debut over that left wing spot. Aro and Casas Casado round out the front line. Moeller, Somerville, and Kavanaugh in the middle. Pereira, Garcia, Alonso, Sigurd Jorgensen, and Callum Tierney. Make up the back line of defense. And Kai Phoenix starts between the sticks. It's going to be a good one here between Barrow and Chelsea. We know that these two teams love playing each other because it's always high-flying action. And let's make sure that we take care of business and come out the victors in this one and set ourselves up to get into the EFL Cup final. And it starts today. Barrow and Chelsea. Come on, boys. Here we go, boys. It's Barrow and Chelsea from Stamford Bridge. The boys in black and yellow tonight looking to make a statement here in the semifinals of the Carabao Cup. Come on, boys. Here's Conte. He's looking for Kennedy. Oh, that's an acres of space for Kai Havertz. He's open the scoring here. Chelsea get the early goal here to start this one off in the semifinal. And it was poor defending there. From Garcia Alonso and Sigurd Jorgensen. And it's high pressure. High pressure from Chelsea winning the ball back. Here's Kennedy out wide. Callum Tierney doing some defending. And Kubo's all by himself. What are you doing, Pereira? And Ruiz nearly putting it home there. Not good defending at all from the Barrow boys in the first 20 minutes. They need to figure it out and figure it out pretty quickly because this isn't gonna this isn't gonna get us anywhere. Moeller, he finds Aro. That's a nice turn. Getting around Varane, and that's a good shot and a save from Pickford. Beautiful stuff there from the Chelsea goalkeeper. Sigurd Jorgensen all over him like white on rice. That's a good tackle from Sigurd Jorgensen. It's out of play. Oh, the rest called it for half time. It's 1 0 here between Barrow and Chelsea. Poor defending from the Barrow boys has closed up and shut out Chelsea since their goal. And the offense just need to find their, find their chances and take them. Solomon Otobor gets around one. Suchek with the tackle, but Moeller skips onto the ball. Moeller still running, Moeller. Still going. Cuts it back. It's Vinal Aro. The Valente missed his interception and Vinyl Aro sticking that one top bins every day of the week. Perfect run and a perfect pass and a perfect finish. It doesn't get any better than that. And that's one back for the Barrow boys here in the semifinal of the Carabao Cup. First leg in London. 
Easy interception there from Sigurd Jorgensen, and we can get out. All of Solomon Otabor trying to get off the ball, and it's just too much pressure at the moment. Abel Reeves making a run. Ref says he's still on side somehow. So you're drawing some nice tackle. Kubo keeps it still. Havertz, nice block. Uh, Garcia Alonso. Well, that's a good shot from Conte. He's barely missed that one. I thought that was in the top bins. Tierney and Pereira in his way to block that angle. And it was just going wide every, every step of the way. Good block, Abel Reeves, another good block for Garcia Alonso, but it falls to Kubo. Fuck you, game. All the good defending we've done today, and you just go and do that. Come on now, reward us. Here's God's will. Here's Aro, trying to get around. Gets around one. Vinyl Aro still going. Pickford with the save. Keeping Chelsea in the lead there. Pereira. Go back to Moeller. Still running Moeller, and Gallagher gets the interception. Not much time left. Kennedy looking over the top. Garcia Alonso heads away. Ref blows the final whistle, and it's a first leg defeat in Stanford Bridge. Very unlucky for the boys to lose this one because we didn't deserve to lose this one. We we played so well defensively. We we're blocking shots, and then Kubo just gets the lucky bounce and finishes. And it's it's annoying, very annoying, because we had more chances than them and just couldn't put them home. So let's bounce back, though. We have Leicester on the end of the week, and the end of the week. So let's do what we gotta do. Come on, boys. Back at Holker Street. Back at home for the boys in blue. And a couple changes to the starting 11 due to tired legs in Aro, Moeller, Kavanaugh, and Pereira. So just giving them the rest for today, letting other players get a start. But we take on Leicester City, who throttled us, absolutely battered us last time out against them. So it's more of a revenge game here at home. Adli, Linares, Lando up front, Rogers, Radoshevic, and Milton, De Carvalho, Antonio. In the midfield, Cash, Garcia Alonso, Sigurd Jorgensen, Tonye, and Kai Phoenix between the sticks. We need a win. It's snowing, and we need a win. Come on, boys. Here we go, boys. Barrow and Leicester City on a snow day in Barrow. Come on, boys. Let's take care of business. It's a good header down from Radoshevich. Here's Linares. He'll look out wide for Oddly, who cuts inside. Acres of space to run into. Still going. Finds Rogers. Back heel to Oddly. And it's 1 0. That was cheeky and very clever from the young English midfielder. That was nice. Nice interchanging play there. Good counter attacking play from the Borough Boys. It doesn't get any better than that. Very high pressure here from the Leicester City Boys, but. I think we've all but broken that press. Here's Oddly. Touch is just heavy. It's good defending from Leicester City. I will say that. Let's take notes from Chelsea. Lando goes forward. Here's Linares. He's through the lines. Right-footed strike. And it's 2-0 right before the half. They can do all the scouting and preparing they want. But sometimes the runs are just happening too quickly. For anyone to cover. And it's 2-0 to the Borough boys here at home in the snow. There goes the halftime whistle. Leicester nil. Borrow to the host. Just running rampant on the counterattacks at the moment. Leicester dominating possession. But once the Borough boys are on the, on the ball, it all seems to be going one way. And it's into the back of the net. Got to do a little bit more going forward. Control the possession now. 2-0. Let's end this game in the second half. From Beltran. We go to Herrera. It's a great step from Sigurd Jorgensen. Wonderful stuff there. Lando inside for Linares. Can he get the better Joel Matip? Oh, yeah. He's got him on pace. 
And he's got the finish as well. Linares, Luis, Linares. It's 3-0 to the Barro boys. A rifle off the left foot from Linares there. Beautiful. Oddly. On the run now. Oh, that needs to be a better ball, son. Come on now. Rogers. Rogers still. Rogers still. Joseph Bratosevich. Kobo with a good save. That was dangerous from the boys there. Oh, that's an interesting ball. But that does it here. It's a 3 0 win for the Barrow boys over Leicester City. The revenge game is complete. We get a good win. We bounce back well after that Chelsea game. It's wonderful and beautiful. Come on, boys. Great win. Great team win. Linares gets two goals. Lando getting a nice assist as well. And the boys just overpowered the the Leicester team. Just absolutely overpowered them. And I love it. Let's get to the next game against Liverpool. Lots of rotation in the starting 11 for this one as we take a trip to Anfield. We have Man City in three days' time, and we got to keep the legs as fresh as possible. Solomon Altabor over the left, Aro and Casas Casado over the right, Moeller, Somerville, and Milton, De Carvalho, Antonio in the middle, Pereira, Parker, Sigurd Jorgensen, Tierney, and Kai Phoenix between the sticks. This is a team that we know all too well. We know exactly how to beat this team. Wear them down, let them tire themselves out, and then go for the throat. Come on, boys. Anfield is the venue. Rainy day on the 17th of January, 2027. My 26th birthday in real life would be that day. Liverpool and Barrow. Come on, boys. An absolutely beautiful night here at Anfield. Liverpool and Barrow. It's packed to the brim here as it is a top seven matchup. Barrow sitting in fourth. Liverpool sitting in seventh, but only separated by two points. It's Solomon Otabor. Trifling challenge there from Rueg. Here's Schengus under. Parker's absolutely floored him there. Didn't get the right side of him at all. It's a free kick to Liverpool early in this one. Pogba whipping in. Only finds the head of Sigurd Jorgensen. Not the best delivery there from Paul Pogba. And here's Gus Casado on the run out the other way. Still running. Goes for Moeller. Goes across Vinyl Aro. And the league's top scorer is not going to miss a one-on-one -on -one opportunity. It's 1-0 here at Anfield. Come on, boys. Tierney, that's a good tackle. Stay with him. Oh, nearly won it fully there. Bit unlucky. Pogba. We go forward to Ketelaire. Beautiful from Parker. Paraiko. Cengiz under. That's another good tackle from Milton. But the pressure is immense from... Ew, it's a good save from Kai Phoenix on Cengiz under. Liverpool all over Barrow at the moment. And it's great defending. Great goalkeeping as well. I'll go back for Rueg. Pareko finds Pogba. Back to Pogwelo. It's Koke. Good save. Mane hits the rebound. Robertson's a good block from Sigurd Jorgensen. Oh, Tierney's headed straight back into Mane's feet. I wanted him to clear that, but he went for the header instead. Mane. That's a great tackle from Callum Tierney. Get it away, please. Moeller. God's will goes inside for Aro. And Milton, that's a great ball forward. Nearly finding him. Here's God's will. Charging forward. He'll go forward for Cas Casado. Juan can't finish it. Need to finish your dinner, son. The Ketelare. Tierney all over him. Koke. It's end of an action here at Anfield. Mane. Tackle from Ethan Parker is wonderful. And Parker's getting us out the other way. And there it goes. It's a great ball from Ethan Parker to find Vino Aro. And surely now it's two. Vino Aro and being through on goal one-on-one -on -one just is a match made in heaven if you're a Barrow fan. It's 2-0 here at Anfield. 
It's wonderful stuff from the boys in blue. Milton, great tackle there on De Ketelaer. Not a good pass, though, from Ethan Parker. Oh, Mane's through, son! It's a wonderful save from Kai Phoenix. Saved his defense's ass there, and Gus Salo, great turn. Did Aro get back on side on time? Ref says, yes, it's a first half hat trick for him. A perfect ball there from Juan Casas Casado. And Vino Aro completes his hat trick. Three goals for him in this one. And it's 3 0 to borrow in the first half. Shocked he even got on side. And let me just tell you if I include offline saves, it's a lot. First half comes to the close. The Vino Aro hat trick is the deciding factor in this one at the moment. It's a beautiful display from the boys in blue. Three shots, three goals for Vino Aro. It's fantastical. Absolutely wonderful. Not even going to lie. But we love it here. Borrow three, Liverpool nil. And they're going backwards. Moeller on the pressure. Here's Pajuelo. Pogba trying to get through. Parker meets him. Koke, oh, that's a tackle from Sigurd Jorgensen. That's outside the box, ref. Don't fucking play. That's outside. You know it's outside. Bad tackle from Sigurd Jorgensen. Ref saying it's a penalty, but that's... That's not in the box. I'm sorry, ref. That's not. Pogba standing over it. Why do they have the gold badge? We won the league last year. Pogba versus Phoenix. Long run up from Paul Pogba. Oh, he's hit the post and in. That was a wonderful penalty from Paul Pogba. I can't say anything about that. That was a phenomenal. Even if I delve the right way, I'm not saving that because it was off the post and in. Like, I can't do anything about that. Great finish there. No clean sheet for the boys. Parker goes all the way back for Kai Phoenix. And here's Sigurd Jorgensen. Go forward for Vinyl Aro. Is he still on the ball? He's lost it. Not good here for the Borrow boys. Getting real sloppy. That's good from Sigurd Jorgensen to win it back for us. Somerville goes for Casado. He's got acres of space to run with. Acres and acres of space for Casado. Cuts inside on his right. And he's finished. It's four. Four goals to one. Cus Casado gets himself onto the score sheet. And he makes it four here against Liverpool for the Barrow boys. It's wonderful. Oh, Parker trying to find the long ball across the field, but only finds Pajuelo. It's a good tackle from Milton. Somehow Koke's come out with that one. It's a Ketelare. Pogba through. It's off the post and in. Pogba gets a second off of that post. Phoenix closed the angle perfectly and somehow Pogba squeezed that one through. Pogba's just on another on another one today when it comes to this stuff. We can't afford to throw this one away. Come on now. Pogba. It's a great tackle from Ethan Parker. Fuck off, ref. Fuck off. A wonderful tackle there, and the ref's blown his whistle. So annoying. So annoying. Here's the free kick from Paul Pogba. Fucking Tierney's handled it. What the fuck are you doing, Tierney? At least try and hide it. You've batted it down with your hand, son. At least try and hide it. Pogba trying to go for his hat trick. It's a nightmare for Barrow here. He doesn't go the same way and it's three for fucking Pogba. Four, three here. It's a fucking shootout for no reason. Pereira goes forward. Vinyl Aro. Can he get past Virgil van Dijk? He does. And he's missed it. Oh, it's unlucky. The angle was pretty tight, though. I won't I won't say anything bad about that. That was a very tight angle. Good, Solomon. Oh, Tabor. 
It's Gomez. It's in the box. Jordanson's up for it very nicely. Aro turning the corner. And he's found Godswell running through. Is this the time? Is this his moment? Surely now. God's will, Solomon Otabor gets himself on the score sheet, his first for the club, and it's 5-3. Five 5-3 to three. Five, three for the Borough boys. What? <laughs> That's all I can say is what? And Gats Casado's on it again. Is it going to be six? Oh, nearly, but Grabara... Cuts it out before Vinaro gets there. It's 5-3 victory for the Borough boys. Almost threw it away there at the end. Not even a lie. Very much almost threw it away. Uh, that's That was scary. That was scary. I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. But hey, a win's a win. Sloppy defensively. But we'll take it. One last game in this one. It's a midweek game at Holker Street. The Borough Boys playing host to the league leaders, Manchester City. Whew. It's going to be a doozy. Going to be an absolute doozy here as this is a red-hot Manchester City team. But we are playing pretty well as well on this side of the country. Adli Linares, Lando up front, Rogers, Radoshevich, Kavanaugh in the middle, Cash, Garcia, Alonso, Sega Jordan, Santonia, and Kai Phoenix between the sticks. Let's play a perfect game. Let's get out of this one with a huge win over league leaders Manchester City. Borrow and City. Come on, boys. It's first versus second. City and Borrow meeting once again. Here at Olker Street. Come on, boys. The roles reversed this time around. Last season, Manchester City finishing top or er, finishing second to Barrow's first place, our first Premier League title win. And this time around, it's now City in the driver's seat. Why are we giving away so many fucking penalties this episode? Tony a mistiming his tackle there and Sterling goes down in a heap. Everything's off today, tackling wise. Isak standing over it. Four and a half minutes in, about to be the fifth. He's put it top corner. Nothing Kai Phoenix could have done. He dove the right way as well. And he's pissed at Tonya as he should be. Silva going for Laporte. City looking for some spell of possession here. Limer. Sterling. Nice little flick for Isak. Kakia. It's a poor finish. It's off the crossbar. Phoenix forced into a wonderful save after Sterling was not called off sides. Fucking pay attention, side judge. City, it's a nice ball in. Sigurd like Jordanson meets it, though. It's halftime. It's a poor showing from the Leicester boys. I mean, the fucking Borrow boys. What the fuck? That's how mad I am right now, because they fucking aren't playing well. Can't even fucking identify them as fucking Borrow. It's so shit right now. Gifted City the lead. Everything's late. We're playing slow. They can't fucking keep up at the moment. Needs to be fixed in the second half immediately. It's, it's an onslaught from fucking... It's an onslaught from fucking Manchester City right now. Sterling, save Phoenix. Saving us and keeping us in this game right now because no one wants to fucking wake up. Now the boys are just giving the ball away cheaply again. Kavanaugh, that's a great tackle. Lando's through. And Ederson with a wonderful save there. Top quality stuff from the keeper. Rogers. He'll go forward for Linares because the ref doesn't want to fucking call a foul when he's fouled. Rogers. He's through. And Rogers. Taylor Rogers. Uh, equalizes late here for Barrow. Since the ref wants to try and keep City in the fucking lead, we'll fucking go and manually do it ourselves. Taylor Rogers, what a fucking finish, my son. Kavanaugh touch helped out City there. Angelino. 
Two minutes of added time. Inside for Usman Dembele. And it's wonderful from Sigurd Jordanson. Tonya trying to get it down the line for Lando. He's found him. Lando, he goes for Linares. This is a perfect opportunity here. Linares against his former club. It's nearly gone in. Ederson with a wonderful save, and it's a one-all draw here. Wow, wow, wow. What a game between first and second. That was intense. The referees had a fucking nightmare trying to keep fucking us from winning this one, but it doesn't matter. We do what we had to do, and we get our equalizer, and we leave with a point. I'd say I'm happy. Well, that will do it here for episode 91 of Borrow U Squad Road to Glory. The boys looked phenomenal all episode long. Got unlucky against Chelsea. Played poorly for the better of the 90 minutes against City, but scraped out a draw, and that's what we do. And that's what we need to do. Good teams know how to do that. That's exactly what we did. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Borrow You Squad Road to Glory. We are nearing the end, hopefully. We're in January. We're flying right now. And hopefully we can get to the end of the series here very, very soon. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace.